My name is Richard Dorfmeister. I'm Rupert Huber. And uh, we are called Tosca. And we are presenting our new album called Odeon. The original artist albums are always like a diary. So the first track is called Zu Gut, then Ambience. The second track is called What If. And that's a collaboration with uh, Sarah Carlier. We work with longtime friend partner uh, Rodney Hunter. Heatwave uh, is a more building track, so it starts slowly but gets then more into a sort of up tempo beat. From the from the uh, lyrics itself, it doesn't have something to do with heatwave. I would say it was just recorded. I remember when it was really hot in Vienna. JJ, the track is definitely a special one because um, it was again the first time we worked with this vocalist called JJ Jones. Apple pie. Defacement uh, Apple pie. situation and. We had already an idea for that in the same way, but then at the end we said, okay, we take something completely else now. Apple pies, we're all eating apple pies. Track number five, Soda, that's um, another Indian track. That's quite elegant dark, yeah? That's, it's just like a tunnel. It's just like a dark tunnel with a few lights. Merges very well because we did extra long intros and outros coming from the ambience into the intro, which is still the ambience, and then the track starts. And it's part of our ambient experience, which we, we have been working on for quite a while. I use ambient as a term because that everybody understands. I don't like the, the term so much, but I use it, will use it as, yeah. a, as a, a recognition point somehow. Yeah, that's, that's important to mention that it's not ambient like. The ambience, you know, like the music for airports or, or something. Or some musak. Yes, the ambience yeah. is a bit, is not the purest d description anymore. So it's more like a like a sound collage. But when we say ambient, we mean no beat. When you recorded with uh, Chris Ekman for the long project, mm -hmm. the long run of days track. And then at the end we took these vocals and put them um, on the backing track, which was called, which is called Max now. Then there was uh, suddenly um, this guy called Lucas Santana around. He's from Brazil. He's a um, Brazilian singer songwriter. He did an album last year. Just figured out that this backing track we have fits very well with these vocals he, he sent. And I just loved his voice and I said, let's put them, put them together. And so it landed on our album, Mr. Santana. So again, in my brain, he refers to eugenetic. I had a, a teacher um, who was called Roland Neuwirth. He was at the local music school teacher. He did some, some lyrics um, based on that idea with cavallo, which means horse in Italian without any logical meaning. The official CD finishes with uh, Bonjour. It builds up very nicely and it's more of an orchestral, it's an orchestral feeling somehow. Mm -hmm. It's more of an, of an elegant... Darkness. An elegant darkness. We have three versions. We have the original version, then we have a limited CD and there's going to be a deluxe box. 